When sorting out the diversity of life, scientists look for similarities between different organisms. One method of taxonomy groups organisms into three domains of life, the archaea, bacteria and eukarya. The eukarya consists of plants, fungi and animals, and are the cells that you're probably more aware of. These three domains can be grouped into two larger groups, the prokaryotes containing the bacteria and archaea, and the eukaryotes containing the plants, animal and fungi. At the cellular level, these two groups are very distinct. Here you can see the prokaryotic cell on the left has its DNA in a single loop whilst all of the eukaryotic cells, like the one on the right, have their genetic material contained in a membrane-bound organelle, the nucleus. Prokaryotic cells are much smaller than eukaryotic cells by approximately one to two orders of magnitude. You need to know the different features associated with the prokaryotes, which include the presence of a cell wall, a cell membrane, the single DNA loop, which is not enclosed in a nucleus, plasmids, and the cytoplasm. A eukaryotic cell in comparison will also have cytoplasm, a cell membrane, however the genetic material is contained in the nucleus, it also has ribosomes and it may have mitochondria. For the differences between plants and animal cells, check out our next video.